What is going on guys, this Waffle here, and welcome back to some more Stardew Valley. Now last time left off, Penny gave birth to another baby, a baby boy named Prumbus. Can you believe that dumb name was the first name that came up on the list as I'm saying it dumb right in front of Gungus over here? But anyways, there you go Gungus. Uh, anyways, yeah, she gave birth to our uh, second child, we got an achievement called like Full House or something like that. And I need to settle down a little bit because Prumbus is over here, yeah, Prumbus is sleeping right now, so leave you alone for right now let's grab another diamond right there we're going to need that because we have like seven more casks down in the cellar that we need to sprinkle with fairy dust we have to make sure to give gungus a lot of attention now that we have prumbus we don't want any jealousy between them that's absolutely correct penny did you say that last time at the end of last episode i don't think so which by the way was like three weeks ago so apologies for the big gap in uploads over here for stardew valley but hopefully we can get back on track with it right anyways yeah there's like seven more down there but i don't have seven diamonds and i don't think you can buy diamonds can you uh, yeah, I've only got one other diamond over here, unfortunately, so... Uh, well, how, how long until those other things? And by the way, I'm moving so slowly right now. Let's get some espresso through my veins. Lip, and drink that. And 13 hours of those, and then we have another... Oh, what was that? Four day... Oh, yeah, that was the one that just finished up, right? And then Gungus is showing me, yep, there are some over here, 13 hours. Okay, so 13 hours... Well, one day for these ones over here, but 13 hours... That should be doable. We'll be able to do that by the end of the day, so... That way, we could actually get started on uh, processing how many? 114 stars we want. I don't know if we have 114 casks over here. Maybe we have more, maybe less. I don't know, but at least then we'll have all these lined up to finish at the same time. We don't have to wait like an extra week or two or whatever like we're doing right now for these, right? And we're all going to be lined up just like the kegs over in the shed. I even talked about that last episode. Did I forget something over here? I did. I forgot the Iridium and I forgot the uh, bait. So <laughs> you can tell it's been a little while since I played Stardew Valley, right? But anyways, yeah, you can see my inventory is pretty empty right now. I think that's because we left a lot of stuff over in the, uh, the, oh, and we have some mail over here too, but we have some stuff over in the Skull Cavern, because last episode, we did a few more attempts of the Skull Cavern, and unfortunately, we only got as deep as 71, which is coincidentally the deepest we've ever been uh, previously, in previous attempts, so that's kind of crazy, and it's even crazier that we got that deep on a 0.5% luck day, which is insane. But yeah, we ultimately failed that mission, which really sucks. We definitely want, if we want to do it, you guys commented it as well. Uh, we definitely want to have a bunch of staircases. So maybe between now and the next time we get that mission, we'll uh, rack up a bunch of stone and a bunch of staircases. We'll have like 50 staircases or something like that, right? And all I have to do is reach level 50 and then just spam a bunch of staircases, right? So anyways, uh, oh yeah, yeah, Dr. Harvey. Yeah, because we died at the end of last, or like fell asleep at the end of last episode. So anyways, let me get, whoa, I don't need to go there, remember? We have these teleports over here. That's what I'm talking about. I, I completely forgot about how to play the game. <laughs> Let's just go up here, let's go grab my stuff. Can I grab that though? I cannot because that's a hammer. Whoops, can't grab those worms. I don't think there's anything inside those worms anyways, but let me go grab my stuff real quick. And speaking of special requests for Mr. Chi, like the cheese hungry challenge, I want to go back to him because today's Monday and I want to try and get another quest. Oh yeah, let's grab all this stuff here. Jeez, I just left it all behind. And I'll leave the bombs and the staircases behind here. That way we could use those next time I'm here, right? But anyways, let me reorganize this real quick. Oh yeah, and then we have another uh, purple slime egg. I forgot to put that up. Whoops. So let's definitely go put that up inside the new slime hutch. And I guess we'll start focusing on that a little bit more because we haven't ever had it until like literally the end of the heckin' series, right? So anyways, let's go back home real quick. Oh yeah, you know what? We have Sam and Dinner right here. I even mentioned last episode. Yeah, let's definitely give uh, Sam and Dinner to Alex. Continue getting his friendship up because I think he's still at the bottom of our friendship list right now, right? So <laughs> definitely want to do that. Let's figure out where he's at. He was in the uh, the gym last time, the gym of the... Uh, the bathhouse over there, so let's figure out where he is right now. Should be either like he okay, yeah, he's over there with Evelyn and George and whatnot, so that's good. So we can go over there real quick, but let me go put that purple slime egg up over here so it starts incubating. I think it takes like a day or something like that. Let's go see. Make sure I can kill these guys over here, too. And I think you guys said, yeah, I think you guys said these are both female slimes, so we're not going to get any more slimes here for a little while. The male ones are the one with the antenna, right? So that's going to be something to look forward to here in the future. Maybe that purple one, maybe this, uh, whatever that. I guess they're both purple. Okay, maybe one of the purple ones are going to be a male, right? That'd be pretty cool. I wonder if the purple, I, I wonder if the colors can only breed with other of the same colors, or if they can, like, interbreed, and then we'd have, like, mix of colors, like, like, not actually, I don't know. What do you even get when you mix green and purple together? I don't even know. Because those are both, like, secondary colors. I don't know, maybe, like, brown or something? I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, uh, wait, what? The eels want the scroll? Wait, didn't I give that to him? I thought I gave them the scroll last episode, or maybe I didn't. Maybe I said, oh, yeah. Uh, we'll do that next episode and as I blow up my heckin' door right there, jeez. <laughs> Let's see, yeah, I have it right there. I see me, I, I really remember fondly getting this scroll, but it might have been at the end of the episode where it, like, doesn't save this extra progress, right? But anyways, randomly throw a scroll into the red water over there, <laughs> and now those guys are jumping for joy. But anyways, yeah, let's go find Alex. Hopefully he's still over there with uh, Evelyn and George and go give him the salmon dinner, which we still have, which is good. Is there anyone else, by the way, on my list that's uh, relatively low that we might want to start bringing up a little bit more yeah there's sandy there 
Uh, we're just in the desert. I guess we could do that a little bit later. What do we know that she likes? Uh, cactus fruit, which we literally got in the desert just a minute ago. I don't know what she loves, though. So maybe I'll just give her cactus fruit just to be safe, because I've got an iridium one in my inventory right now. There you go, you poor burnt thing. Well, there you go, you get a cactus randomly. I didn't even clip off the thorns or anything like that. That's your problem now. <laughs> and casually dodge her too, because that counts too. And she's at six out of 10 hearts right there. Cool. Glad the bus is back at service. Yeah, she says that all the time. Not that big of a deal. There you go, play my horse's song. Yeah, I've got, yeah, I even mentioned last episode, I wanted to give my horse another, oh, ooh, look at this. I know we're probably not going to get anything good out of these, but yeah, mix seeds and uh, whatever the winter root. Yeah, winter root. No, no, you're not getting anything good there. It only makes sense to mine up stuff on the island. But anyways, let's go over here. I haven't even checked. He might be gone. He might be completely... Oh, is that him? No, it's Abigail. Oh, wait. Oh, what, what about that? No, it's just Mary Lewis. Okay. <laughs> I was about to say, is that them literally... Is that Alex walking away as I'm heading over here? <laughs> He's probably not even here. He's not even here. Okay, jeez. I should have checked the map. <laughs> Where is he? I doubt he is in the... Man! So we have the sashi or the yeah we have the salmon dinner so look, there you go we're down the weights and hey awesome i love this stuff cool so he's still at eight out of or a three out of eight how's that even possible Ugh, can't talk oh i guess he just says that all the time so does that actually count the ug uh, can't talk does that actually count as talking to him though or uh i guess it, okay that's good so we gave him yeah so this was something weird we gave him a salmon dinner yesterday uh last episode and it was sunday but it's still it, like gifting the week starts on sunday but like missions the week starts on monday i know someone commented that last episode too it's very strange i don't know why it's like inconsistent like that but whatever well, let's just go down to the town now because we have a special request board down there we can get the you know special requests from i don't know is there anything we haven't even done over here yeah robin's resource rush biome balance yeah we've done this a thousand times we've done biome uh, you know fishing random fish a thousand times before for both demetrius and robin so I don't know. I'm like, we do need the stone for the staircases, like I said. So I think I think it makes most sense to do Robin's mission there for a thousand pieces of stone, which is super, super easy if I just take some bombs into the uh, island dungeon. Because I know over there, there's a bunch of stone that's more grouped together. So we could actually get more stone a little bit quicker over there. And we almost got, we had a mission just like that not too long ago where we got like 700 stone on the first day, which was insane. So I know speaking of the island, uh, is there really anyone I could buy? Yeah, there is someone I could buy bombs from on the island. But they're either on level five of the dungeon, so we can't get to them immediately. So let's, let's just go ride the minecart over to the mines. Go buy some uh, bombs from the dwarf guy over here. And I guess we can get some espresso, too, because I'm moving rather slowly again. <laughs> oh, jeez. Yeah, it's been a little while since I came over here. So, yeah, coffee beans are all done. These trees are all done. Jeez. Yeah, let's go, let's go get that mission for uh, Mr. Chief first so I don't spend too much time over here. And, uh, you know, waste out on any potential time we could be using to further his mission that he's going to be giving us. All right, let's see. Hopefully something good. Cheese kindness. Give 50 loved gifts in one week. How could we do that? And the danger in the deep. The mine elevator system has now been reset. And new dangers have emerged from deep underground. Make it to the bottom of the mines in one week. Huh. 50 chi gems for that? 40 for the 50 loved gifts one, though. But how many, if I just look at the list of people, like especially people here at the very top, we already know Penny. We can give her a gift every day because she, she's my wife. So we're not we're not limited to two uh, gifts per week, right? And look at all the gifts. Holy hell, well, I have been kind of using her as a recycling machine for random artifacts and whatnot, all right? So that's why those are all there. But we need to give her emerald basically every day. So that's seven right there. Uh, well, six, because today's Monday. I already gave her a gift today, but still. Wait, did I get? No, I didn't give her a gift today. I just talked to her. Yeah. So I can give her an emerald. So that, that'd be good. So we basically need to give eight people seven gifts or, you know, every, well, yeah, we can't do that because everyone else that I'm not married to, <laughs> I can only give twice a week to, right? Yeah, so like Robin, we know, okay, we don't even know anything she loves, she's just liked. Well, we know Autumn's Bounty, I don't know if I even have any of that, but it seems pretty good because it gives you like defense or whatever. Vincent, uh, can, and then yeah, grapes, we can give that, that's pretty easy there. Demetrius, bean hot pot, don't know how we got that, uh, but I'm pretty sure we have a lot of green beans, we might be able to make the hell on, can I do this? That's the wrong button. There you go. Oh, it's just two. Wow, that's easy. Two green beans. Yeah. Okay, Demetrius, I could do that. Man, I don't know. Maybe a little bit later, but I kind I kind of like the combat one over here. You know, danger in the deep, the mine elevator. Now, which one is that? Is that the one that's in Pelican Down or the the one that's because we're here on the island right now? Well, actually, yeah. Now now I think about it, the only one with an elevator is the one in Pelican Down, right? So I kind of I like this mission, and we have the bombs. We need to get the stone. I like the sound of this. Now, it doesn't need to be all in like one day or whatever. It says right there down down to the bottom of the mines within one week. We could do that. So we could start today and then just continue, right? So I guess we'll do that. And I guess we'll see if we have any food that gives us extra defense and whatnot. And of course, we could use food as much as we want. So that's awesome there. 
I'm liking the danger in the deep. Maybe like off camera or some of that, I could start like building out an itinerary for cheese kindness if we ever get that again, like next week or whatever, right? This mission might be actually really good. I just saw the uh, the slimes up there. This mission might be really good for uh, finishing up that slime, you know, you know, kill a thousand slimes or whatever that mission was for the Adventure Guild. Because the guy said if I kill a thousand slimes, the guy in the Adventure Guild is going to give us like a ring or something like that. That makes it where slimes don't do any damage to us anymore. So that's going to be really good, especially in that new uh, slime hutch thing that we built. And that's going to be all the coffee right there. Okay, good. So let's just teleport back home. We can always uh, summon in the horse a little bit later. Not that big of a deal. Let's just go back home. I guess we'll drop off some of the stuff so we can uh, clean our inventory out. Yeah, so I've got a lot of random trash in my inventory. So let me clean that out real quick. All right, so is there anything here that gives me like plus defense or whatever? It might be really good. Well, that's binding. Well, the crab cakes, yeah. Oh yeah, what was it? It was like eel. Uh... There it is right there, spicy eel. Oh yeah, that's plus one lucky plus one speed. That was really good in the uh, skull cavern, but I don't know about this. Root Platter gives us a plus three attack, which might be good if these are going to be a lot more difficult enemies, right? So Root Platter, does that mean Cave Carrot Root? Wow, holy heck, wait, we have that in here, don't we? Yeah, we have Cave Carrot. Oh, I just ate a Winter Root a second ago. We have 20 Cave Carrots right there. We might be able to make some Root Platter if I have some uh, Winter I'm like, it's Winter right now, so if I don't have any over here. Yeah, wow, we've got tons. Holy heck, yeah, let's get some uh, Root Platter. That seems really good, you guys, so it's going to give us extra defense or uh, extra attack, but that doesn't really matter with the defense because we can eat as much as we want, right? So... There it is right there. I can make 20 of them. Yeah, let's do it. Yeah, it's going to be better than the sum of its parts, right? So, whoa, achievement cook. Holy hey, now is that how many, how many recipes is that? Because I know you get an achievement. Ah, I guess I'll look it up here in a second. I know you get that achievement for getting a certain amount of recipes, right? So, you get like three. That seems good for right now. And that probably gives us a little bit of health and energy and stuff too, but uh, you can check the achievements here. We got cook, I think it was called. Oh, it's only, I only made 10. I was thinking in my head, oh, maybe I made like 20 or something like that, but I only made 10. <laughs> Jeez, okay, yeah. Definitely want to start. I think the next one's like, what, uh, all of them are... Oh, wait, no, 25. Okay, yeah. So I need to double and a half what I've done so far. <laughs> and we have how much time? Uh, about two... Okay, so we're basically full on that, so that's good. And let's get the root splatter going so we can get ourselves some extra damage, right? Or attack damage, whatever you want to call it. So there you go. Let's see how difficult this actually is. Let's go. It doesn't seem to be... Oh, yeah, we, uh, we have to start from this. I forget, yeah, because the elevator's not working, right? But what does this mean? Is there a... Just lay off a mega... Is that too big of a... Wow, that was like perfect right there, you guys. Okay, at least we got a lot of stone, but so far nothing's... Oh, whoa, whoa, what are these? A slime wearing sunglasses, what? Holy heck. And that's a male too, because we already know. Hold on, hold on, hold on. And, oh, oh, is that? Hold on, hold on. I knew I was probably going damage me. Yeah, radioactive ore, oh, okay. So now we finally get the radioactive ore. Oh my gosh. So is this... Wait, is this, is this permanent? Is this forever now? Or is this only during this event that I can get the radioactive ore? I don't know. Another thing of uh, Mega Bomb right there. Awesome. And it, wow, I didn't even kill this. I thought it did. And that's a female one with sunglasses. <laughs> and it dropped a staircase right there. Cool. Oh, yeah. Definitely want to see what's inside of the barrels because we might get some better stuff. How are we doing on stone? 132 from only two layers. Honestly, these guys don't feel that much more difficult. I'm like, I know we're literally at the very beginning, like at the bottom of the heckin' thing. And it's only going to get more difficult the deeper we get, right? But this doesn't seem too bad so far. Like, we haven't. Okay, literally right there, we get damaged. <laughs> And then uh, I'm doing a lot of, I'm doing literally triple digit damage. These guys are doing single digit damage back to me. So doesn't seem that bad, but uh, let's lay down another mega bomb. All right, I probably should have bought more, honestly. And I can, cause I'm like right here at the heck of mines, right? And I do know we could have gone down right there, but I'm like, look at all the slimes I can get some progress on. Uh, I just don't know what I'm, uh, how many I need to actually kill. We don't need copper. Actually, we might need copper. I forget if we need, what the heck? Why is there coral down here? The heck? I'm like, I'm not complaining. Cause we could use that for a, uh, Crafting fertilizers and whatnot, right? I think. Or maybe something else. I don't know. Like I said, it's been like three weeks since I last played, so I might be misremembering like crazy, but now we're starting to die over here. Well, anyway, yeah, we do have the roots platter giving us extra damage. I completely forgot about that. Literally the thing that we just went out of our way to craft. <laughs> there, you get another bomb up there. You get another bomb up here. Let's do another mega bomb right there. That seems like a good area. It's not going to damage the actual guy himself. Yeah, 63 damage. Yeah, not enough to kill him. At least we have a way to get down right there, though, so that's good. We got three slimes like stacked on top of each other over there. Did you see that? These guys drop anything, like, exclusive? I don't think so. I think they're just basically just reskin slimes, right? Oh man, my espresso ran out. Hold on. There you go. Drink some more espresso. There you go. Get another uh, bomb going, because we have so many heckin' uh, stone. We still need to get 2 to 40. feel like I made more progress than that, but yeah. I might be just misremembering, because I'm kind of used to how clumped together it is over in the Skull Cavern. And the, uh, not the Skull Cavern, but uh, the island, right? The island. Uh... Yeah, see, they're like stacked on top. What in the world? They're like heckin' slime rancher slimes over here. <laughs> 
I know, yeah, we can go down another layer right now. We haven't taken that much damage, honestly. So, oh, yeah, I haven't had to use that yet either. And wow, we made it to the first elevator uh, right there. So I assume it starts working from now on, huh? So, uh, let's see. Let's actually go here, and then I guess we'll do a regular bomb there. Yeah, another three slimes stacked on top of each other on the bottom left there. And we already found another staircase down. So, oh, wow, look at all of them right there. Holy heck, doing Mega Bomb right there. Two stacks of slimes. Let's see if we can actually, uh, maybe, you know what? Uh, that didn't really do as much as I thought it was going to do, but... I guess it knocks off the slimes that are on top of it whenever you just hit them. Wow, green, uh... Wait, these are supposed to be green slimes? I guess so. Like, they're, is it going to be anything special? Is it going to give me the ones with the sunglasses whenever I incubate that? I don't think so. Let's just keep exploding around here, even though we already have... Whoa, whoa, whoa we have another crab guy. I th yeah, I think we already killed all the rock crabs, have we? Oh, speaking of such, there's another one, like, right here. Is this one going to come out? I guess not. Another rock crab right there. Kind of obvious. <laughs> Throw another bomb right there, just kind of get some more stone, because we're at 292. Oh, man, we, okay, we broke his heckin' uh, protective shell right there. Whoopsie daisy, but... <laughs> what was that? Another rock crab? It is! Man, there are a lot of rock crabs here. And we actually get the crab right there. Can I pick him up? Why get it? There you go. Cool. <laughs> Alright, let's go down to the lair. This is pretty fun, I like this. Oh, man, it's already 10 p.m. What in the world? I'm gonna have to leave here somewhat soon, but... There you go, another bomb. And another slime. And another uh, bit of stone right there, not bad. And cherry bombs, it's not too bad either. Is there a new... Dougie, doesn't seem like it, okay. Let's do a bomb right here. Oh man, more radioactive ore right there, good. What do we use that for? Because we haven't had any, oh yeah, I, I think there was, wasn't there something I was trying to grab one time? A while ago, where I was like, oh man, radioactive ore. Oh wow, it takes forever to mine that though, so might wanna, it seems like it, it breaks a little bit fast. Wow, amethyst, I was about to say, why'd you give me a purple slime egg? <laughs> but uh, yeah, it seems like it, it's easier if you just explode them, right, with a bomb. I'm like, I know that's Jade right there, but uh, I, th I feel like whenever we have a radioactive war and then we have a bomb next to it, it breaks a little bit easier, a little bit faster, right? But anyways, grab that crab. There we go. And I don't know, let's do a bomb right here. There you go. There's some slimes right there and a bunch of stone. It's going to clean it up a little bit for me, right? So there you go. Yeah, at least I'm getting a lot of slimes killed right here. Hopefully we're going to get that thing unlocked. I wish there was a... There probably is a mod axe I could install that like tells me the progress I need. Uh, yeah, there is a new Dougie right there, so w what's new about this Dougie? Can I see? Oh! It's kind of golden looking. Wait, my inventory is full. I can't get whatever that is. Or is it talking about the cherry? No, yeah, because I can pick up the cherry bomb. No problem. I guess I put the stone inside the, uh, what is that? Yam? What the heck is it giving me a yam for? <laughs> I don't know, but I'm going to complain. So I'll uh, do another. Yeah, you know, let's do a mega bomb right there. Seems like a big enough area. So, uh, is this? Wow, I'm like just barely outside of range. Oh man, now I can't pick up the stone anymore. Uh, yeah, I, I, I don't need to have the slingshot anymore, honestly. It doesn't make sense having that anymore, but is there anything I can actually drop right here? Like one sap, sure, and I can get a little bit. Okay, never mind. I don't. I don't get any money out of that. <laughs> Let's keep going around here, though. But oh, what in the world? There's seaweed. Is that seaweed? What the? And it's getting the ass midnight right now, man. Yeah, there's like seaweed. I'm like, we just saw coral a minute ago, so I shouldn't be too surprised. But wait, hold on. Is that it? Wait, that wasn't. Wait, was that the one for the rock crab? I have to go see Gil for the uh the the thing, but I think he closed at either ten or eleven, something like that, right? Yeah, I can't. I can't get whatever that is. Seaweed. So that kind of sucks. I guess I can get the copper, right? Yeah, there you go. Guess I'll grab that. So I made it to level seven. Try to keep going down. Yeah, let's keep going down. We're going to be at level eight. At least we'll unlock the next elevator, right? So we have plenty of time. It's not that big of a deal. We, uh, oh, we got copper right there, though. So we can get some more uh, progress going down here real quick. If not, I, I don't, I don't want to spend any uh, stone trying to make a heck of staircase, right? So just to blow some more stuff up right there and right here. We have some more sap there, but I don't need that. Okay, nice. We can make it to level nine. It's more of the stone. Awesome. It's only... Uh, oh man, oh my gosh, look at all the heckin' slimes in here, this is insane. Yeah, that's gonna get rid of all- okay, nice, we made it to level 10, right? So that's good. So if we actually gather all these slimes together, do some damage with them all together like this, because we're taking, like, no damage from them. <laughs> there you go, yeah, slice them up. Oh, there we go! Wait, cheat you- wait, why did it give me a cheat gem right there? The heck? What happened? Did I pick one up randomly right there, or...? I don't know, but, uh, anyways. Yes, 120, yeah, I definitely want to go here, unlock this. Uh, yep, level 10, we unlock the elevator, so we can go up to level 0 now. Cool. So, is that permanent now, or is it going to go back to normal? I don't know. Let's go back to the bus stop, though. And, uh, summon in my horse, wherever the thing is. Horse fleet. There it is, right there. Summon him in. Let's go home. Before I can fall asleep out here again two days in a row, right? <laughs> Alright, let's go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Yeah, is there 10% progress right there on the first day? Not bad. I'm like, I started at, like, 5 p.m., so you can't really say oh, that was the first full day or anything like that. But yeah, we're at 1,000, uh, 1,135 stone right there, so that's actually pretty good, you guys. Not bad for the first, you know, quarter day or whatever you want to call that, huh? And yeah, radioactive war. So what do we use it for? Magic bait? Oh, okay, so if I get the recipe, I can make the magic bait, and then the hyperspeed grow. 
and then put yeah well yeah make a radioactive bar out of it by putting it in. i can get a turtleneck sweater is it going to be like really glowy looking like glow in the dark or something i wonder but uh yeah let's go let's go to bed let's go to bed i can actually make it to bed i'm taking a crab into bed what in the world am i doing <laughs> All right, day 22 of winter, year three. Remember, we have Feast of the Winter Star. Probably next episode, right? Oh, I forgot to get the diamonds. Get the, yeah, we'll do it right now. Diamonds are done right now. They finished up a little bit earlier. Uh, but at least we'll have all the casks in the basement done at the same time, right? So there you go. A male slime. Hey, whoa. So now, because we have female slimes, now we could actually have slime babies, perhaps? How long is that going to take for them to actually, you know, do what they need to do? <laughs> I don't know. But there you go, water the cacti, it's been a little while, and let's go up here to grab the diamonds. I need one of these ones, five more hours till those other random shraggler ones finish up, but yeah. We just need to get seven, and we just got seven right there, so uh, now we can make enough fairy dust in order to uh, get all the... I should have stopped yelling right there next to Prumbus is his name? I forget. <laughs> I don't know, what do you have to say, Penny? A nice house, two wonderful kids, and a beautiful plot of land. <sighs> We're so very fortunate. That's right, Penny, we absolutely are. We absolutely are. And you know what? I have a gift in the form of a random dwarf scroll. There you go. Thank you. This looks special. Absolutely. <laughs> Even though I'm not doing that mission to give everyone loved gifts, I'm still giving loved gifts to my loving wife. So let's go down. Let's go grab the, uh, what is it, the fairy dust now? I just need to get seven of them. Well, yeah, you know what? How many can I actually make? Let's make as many so we can. So we have extras left over, you know? So there we go. 14. Uh, so we could actually have, you know, start stockpiling them. Start, start stockpiling them over here. Jeez, I can't talk today. <laughs> Anyways, we just need to get seven, like I said, and let's grab the uh, 114. Yeah, it's going to take a while. I, I need to go up here for this other one, right? But yeah, they're all gold star now, which is awesome. Some of them were already gold star, but uh, I didn't have enough fairy dust. But there we go. That's iridium and grab the, uh, what is it going to finish up? Right? Oh, I can't, I can't sprinkle that one from all the way over here. Man, too far away, but let me sprinkle these real quick and put down a uh, regular star fruit in their place. And I think the shed might be finished up with some more ancient fruit wine, which we just sell right at the bat. We can't age that, unfortunately. These are the last few right here, and this is the last one. Boom! I guess I'll start getting these going over here. There you go. And let me get... Oh, whoops! No, don't drink them! Jeez, I am, uh... What do you call it? Sober. That's what it's called. Don't question why it took me so long to remember what that word was. <laughs> Trying to set a good example for our family with a mother-in-law that might be questionably sober, right? Yeah, look at it right now. I don't know. Do we have exactly enough? Did I specifically get 114, or...? Wow, we have two left over. Is there two casks? Just casks sitting around not doing anything? If so, then I... Okay, it looks like 112 is the best we could do. I don't know. It, I might as well look that up right now. What is the most efficient basement, cellar, Stardew Valley... What do you want to call it? Uh, layout. I want to compare my layout that I did on my own to whatever the best layout would be. Okay, never mind. I found one where someone says they have 121 casks. Man! Well, 112... It's not too far off from that nine more. Where would they even put that? What in the world? I'll show you guys a screenshot if I find it again later. But man, it looks like there's a lot more open space in this picture than there is in my uh, my cellar here, you know? I don't know how they did that, but uh, I guess they did. So I guess we'll put the extra two over there and uh, only get 110 more and then we'll have enough for the next round, right? But that's going to be what? Two months from now? How long did that take to do a whole entire set right? Two months or something? It's insane? I think so, right? Golly. But anyways, like I said a minute ago, uh, oh, what in the world? Where's my... Oh, here is right here. Yeah, my hot bar is all sorts of hecked up. And yep, uh, like I was trying to say a minute ago, we have the ancient fruit over here done, which is awesome. And we just got a lot, oh, we just got a lot of coffee done. Uh, yeah, so we have a lot of coffee. Should I do another few rounds of coffee over here? Or should I do more star fruit? I'm like, I have so many espresso. Like 161 espresso in the, in the fridge already. So I don't think I need coffee right now. Yeah. Well, let's get the, let's get the star fruit going again. And you know what? Because we don't have this full of casks yet. How do we make more casks? Can I afford it? Wood, copper, iron, oak, resin. Um, I'll look at that here in just a second, but let me get all the uh, star fruit wine, or ancient fruit wine from all these real quick. Oh yeah, and let's go pay Gil a visit. Let's go see what... I'm pretty sure it was rock crabs, but I, at the same time, I feel like we already finished the rock crabs mission. And I guess while we're there, we can see what our progress is on killing enough slimes. There you go, so that's good. So I don't know how many kegs I need. I think we counted out one time, and it was like 12 or something like that, so... Let's go see if I could actually make any kegs with uh, how much wood we have and the oak resin, etc., etc. right? So, uh, I could just make one? What? Oh, yeah, I don't have, like, any wood. What in the world? Where'd all my wood go? Man, I probably should have... Robert should have given me a mission for getting a thousand wood instead of a thousand stone. Yeah, like, anyways, at least we have one more keg right there, right? Oh, yeah, and then we have two more outside, so that's pretty good. But, uh, yeah, definitely want to try and, you know, finish this 100%, right? <laughs> Let's get some uh, star fruit to go in over here. Right, let's get that and that. And that's probably all we really need, honestly. Oh, wow. I'm off only by four right there. That's insane. 
So I guess we'll put those up and, uh... Actually, hold on, let me see. Did I miss any here? Yeah, it doesn't look like we... Oh, yeah, then we have two more kegs outside. I forgot about that. Let's grab those. Yeah, let's get those going over here. Let's go over here. Let's go look at our new male slime. Oh, it's a purple one. Okay, so... Oh, man, now, see, this is what I'm talking about. Now I'm getting slimed and slowed down over here. It's insane, but incubate another green. So we have another purple going right now. Hopefully, it's going to be a female and we can actually start breeding slimes and whatnot. I don't. Even, I still don't even know what the actual objective of having a slime is. Sell, uh, 288,750 gold from the ancient fruit wine. Don't mind if I do. And 44,000 from only seven iridium star fruit wine. That just goes to show how valuable those are now. <laughs> Man. And you know what? Whenever we find staircases in the, uh, whatever it's called, the mine, let's definitely take it. Let's not, let's try and deprioritize killing slimes during this because we kind of want to get those chi gems, right? <laughs> we can kill slimes whenever we need to. We can only get the chi gems for this mission during this week so let's try and make a good amount of progress tonight all right i've got a bunch of bombs 100 regular bombs 56 mega bombs because i misclicked <laughs> now i have way more than i actually need right so let's go check up on the adventures guild real quick and at least we'll be starting a little bit earlier today compared to yesterday so at least we're not starting at like 5 p.m at least we're starting at maybe 2 33 or something like that right i need to kill 20 21 more slimes of course there's that heckin number again and i'm pretty sure it was a cave uh what's it called rock crab wait what crab shell ring from the top, the top of the ring is made out of an... So plus five to... Hold on. How would I incorporate that into these? Because right now we have like vampire luck uh, combined with iridium band, right? So I guess we can make another iridium band and combine it together with a crab shell ring. I don't know if you're... I don't think you're able to combine already combined rings, you know? So how do you make an iridium band again? Is that easy? Iridium bar solar... Oh, wow, 50 of each. I think we could buy solar essence, but I don't know about void essence. Oh wait, yeah, we could buy solar essence, but you can only get 10 at a time, same with void, void essence. So take like five days buying them every day from the sewer guy, right? So, man, that's something to think about. Let me know in the comments down below. What do you guys think about that crap? Because plus five defense, we don't have any defense right now, you know, except for, of course, our boots. Those give us five. So it basically doubles our defense. I guess it'd be good, you know, combined together with a vampire one because it's kind of combat oriented. And then maybe later we'd have a reason to have the luck one. I don't know. I don't know. Let me know. Like I said, let me know in the comments down below. What do you guys think? But I guess we'll do another run here. I don't know how long this episode is, by the way. So uh, I guess I don't know. Is this going to be a two day episode today or maybe three? I don't know. I guess we'll find out whenever I edit all. What? Who's putting ice cream in there? What? I know. Uh, explode a bomb right here. Trying to explode as many stone. If we find a way down, I guess. Okay, yeah. Just like I said, you know what? You know what? He's already damaged. <laughs> there we go. Now we only need to kill 20 more slimes, right? Oh, well, this one we have to go all the way to the end of the thing. So uh, I guess we can try and speed run a little bit. Even though we're moving about as fast as we can. Well, oh, that was a rock crab right there. Okay, yeah. You know what? Ignore him. I don't even need to kill him for the mission. So look. And do we get. Is that coal in there again? Or is that. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, it seems like they didn't reset it with coal. Man. Oh, and there's another Dougie there, but. Whoa, overrun with Monza. Whoops. This is bad. Oh, wait. Oh, you know what? You know what? You know what? Mega bomb right there. What the heck is that? Wait, am I supposed to, Is this technically under... I'm like, I know I saw seaweed and coral just a minute ago, right? But... Oh, no, oh yeah. These guys do drop random chi gems. Huh. But there's a heckin' flying squid like I'm playing Journey to the Savage Planet or something like that. <laughs> wait, hold on. The, the slimes that are stacked on top of each other, does that count whenever I kill them? I don't know. Because it seems like they just disappear whenever you, like, knock them off the, the, the pile of slimes, but... Yeah, this room's definitely going to help us out killing, uh, uh, you know, killing 20... I don't even know how many I need to kill now. But, uh, this... Oh, oh my gosh, there's even more! Look at them all! Golly! Man, at least we're damned... There we go, Monster Slayer! Okay, so we killed all the slimes. Do, do we get a slime ring, or... No, the Chi Gem, wow. I don't know. But yeah, it seems like these actual slimes themselves, they drop the Chi Gems, which is good. So it incentivizes us to actually kill the slimes, but they're doing, like, no damage to me. I'm like, they'd be doing even less damage if I had the plus five defense, which is literally doubling our defense, right? But there, I just need to kill three more slimes here, and then boom, we're good to go. Yeah, this mission helped out tons with the heck and killing the slime thing. Hold on. Any slimes here? Because I killed all of them. I don't know. I don't see any. Where are they at? The heck? There's supposed to be a way down. What in the world? Oh, now it... Golly, why is it so delayed? I think it's supposed to be... Yeah, okay, it appears at the very front when that happens. Yeah, you guys commented that like 10 episodes. Not even 10, probably like 100 episodes ago. <laughs> Whatever the last time that happened. Or like defeat all the enemies. Oh, wow, another way down right there. Nice. I need to get an espresso, though. Uh, but yeah, defeating all the... Oh, wow, that was another... Uh... Elevator there, right? Elevator layer right there. Jeez, try saying that a thousand times fast. There we go. Get a bomb going there. Get another bomb over here as we have some heckin' squid. Oh, wow. Another way. Jeez, we're finding the way down very fast right now, you guys. Let's get another mega bomb right there in this relatively large room. 
And just outside of radius right there. Another way down. Okay, cool. We got a naked rock crab right there. But I don't need to worry. Oh, it's overrun with monsters again. Golly. I'm like, this is slowing us down like crazy. But it's 6 p.m. We could definitely kill these guys again, right? And I don't know. It, like, was it, was it squid? Is that a brand new enemy? Or is it basically just a reskinned version of the, uh, whatever it, it's supposed to be replacing? Because I already forgot where it is. And how am I not drowning of no water? Or a <laughs> no oxygen underwater. I don't know, because it just feels like like we got like coral, we got like seaweed, we got squid, which are actually doing decent damage to us. Oh yeah, obviously this guy's obvious. Like there's no rocks in here at all, but then suddenly there's a heck of a rock right there. Yeah, that was a rock crab. <laughs> You're not hiding from me, hey. The five hundred ten damage, man. There's some great damage with that I can create, huh? But let's kill this last slime here. Hopefully that squid comes over here. There he is. There we go. Awesome. Okay, I got it. What squidding? Oh yeah, we killed squid before, right? Squid kid. So is that just a squid kid? I don't know. Uh, and then, yeah, speaking of squid, we got another squid right there and another slime. Is this is the last one. Nope, we still got some more up here. Man. And another green slime egg, even though these guys are blue. But hey, I'm not complaining. I guess, yeah, like I said, they're basically just reskinned green slimes. So, whoop, kill, kill. Oh my gosh, I'm dying. Oh yeah, we need to get the, uh, we need to eat that anyways. This gives us extra attacks. So that's probably why we're not killing these guys as easily as we did the first time around. Because I've got to eat the heckin' root splatter. And whoop, there, man. Come on, get him. Man, jeez, and then we got another one right here. Man, he's so like slow though. Come on! I know I could make a staircase here, but... Man! Come the heck on, what in the world? Taking you forever, there we go. Okay, now it's way down up here. Jeez. Alright, we're at 18, so we might be able to make it like 25 if we're lucky. That'd be really good, and we got these guys here. Uh, the way down, okay, yeah, let's keep going. Let's keep going down. <laughs> And, oh no, we get the heckin' snail layer here. I don't think we ever- I, I think the only way down ever appears is very middle, right? Man, I'm getting chased at by like three squid right now, it's insane. Or two, I don't know. I don't know how many that actually is, but I'm out running them out. I'm out- oh, what in the world? Okay, nice, I'll take that. And there you go, level 20, noise. Right, let's try and make it down a little bit more, down to level 25. At least make some good progress. Uh, there you go. Yeah, see, it like knocks them off and then it like- they land and then they like die, so... I, I assume that counted? I'm like, it doesn't matter anymore because we already have the heckin' mission done, right? So, uh, anyways, Mega Bomb time. And do another one over here because I got so many of them, right? So there you go. We find the way down. Uh, we did. Okay. Well, I guess I'll grab the. There you go. Because I've got such good magnetism from the two iridium bands or whatever. I I, I think it's the iridium bands that gives me. Oh wow! We finally got heckin' whatever that is. Uh, uranium or whatever that is. Radioactive ore. <laughs> I'm like it's supposed to be uran uranium, right? Let's get some uh melons because we need to heal up a little bit because I'm heckin' dying over here. Jeez. There you go. Can I actually kill these guys any faster now? They have the extra attack. Let's see. Uh, 100 damage there. Oh, yeah, there's only two hits right there. Well, I did two hits to him, but he didn't die. But we have a staircase right here. I'll take it. Now, dude, we can't find heckin' uh, holes in the ground. Man, we've got two duggies right there, but speaking of a hole in the ground, we got a ladder right there. I'll take that. Anything over here, though? Uh, let's get this guy exploded. Let's do another one over here, sure. There we go. Way down? No. Not there either. Man. Oh, there we go. We got one right there. Okay, let's go down. And we got more slimes and more cheese. We got a lot of stuff going on right now, but a uh, mega bomb. Oh, yeah, it's a uh, level 25. Yeah, we definitely made it to level 25 right there. Can we make it level 30, though? Because we got it. Yeah, we got a way down right there. Taking some damage, unfortunately. The heck, it's squid. Man, get out of here. Golly. There we go. Got him. Yeah, let's do a mega bomb right. Probably shouldn't have done that. Seems like it's way too close. I knew I was going to take damage myself. Hey, we got the way down, though. I'll take it. There you go. And yeah, we got more heckin' stuff over here. This is insane. Do another mega bomb right there. I go and knock off those slime. It only knocked off one slime right there. What in the world? It's getting late. Yeah. <sighs> Man. Oh, mega bomb. Or uh. Wait, no, that's not even radioactive ore. That's just a. Uh, was it emerald? I think it is. Didn't even find the way down right there. Man. Can't even pick up the emerald either. <laughs> Come on, find the way down. Wait, seven. We might. Oh, here we go. Here, here, here we go. I might be able to make it to level thirty before the uh. uh like I die or what? Oh wow, Nautilus show. We haven't had one of those in a while. Holy heck, yeah. I'm getting rid of. A uh, cherry bomb. There you go. Pick that up. When the why am I picking up the cherry bomb again? Sell it. Twenty two gold. There you go. <laughs> All right. Hold on. We get anything here? We did. Okay. Let's get out. Let's, what in the something's shooting at me. Hold on. Level twenty nine. Okay. Yeah. We can definitely do this, you guys. Uh, definitely want to heal up though if we're in a relatively safe position. There you go. Still got a few slimes right there stacked on top of each other, but whoop, there you go. Get ourselves some bombs and yeah, throw a bomb right here. There you go. Oh jeez. Yeah. I'm, I'm immediately damaging myself. Golly. <laughs> Uh, let's do another bomb right here. Oh, man, there you go. Uh, two bombs. Eh, whatever. We got so many. We got bombs to spare. Hey, duh. Got another bomb right there. Okay, let's just leave a trail of bombs behind me, I guess. <laughs> there we go. Like we're in the... Oh! Okay, I just barely got out of range right there. Oh, no, I'm gonna get it! Ah, man, I did get it. Hey, there you go. Level 30 at 
20. Whoa, what in the world? Oh, yeah, we don't have any chests, so I guess whatever this spooky theme is, I guess we have that to look forward to next episode. But hey, finally made it to level 30 right there, you guys. Is that level 30? Wait, hold on. What was that? 30 or 25? Yeah, we did make it. So we made it to basically a third in two days. That's decent progress. Yeah, because if we do another two days, oh, we'll be at like level 60 and then another two days after that. We'll be at level 90 and then we have one day left to do 10 more layers. But like I said, it's supposed to get increasingly more difficult the further down you go, right? So what do we do level 10 to 30 right there? So we only made 20 layers in one day, but at least it was better than the 10 I did on the first day, right? So if we come here at like 6 a.m., we might be able to do like 30 or 40 layers. That'd be really good. Especially if I come over here with heckin' staircases and just cheat that way, right? Like, I, I might do that if I start, if it starts coming, like, Sunday night and I'm only on level, like, 85, right? I might just use a bunch of heck of staircases, but I don't know. Can you even use, do they ban staircases there? I don't know, but uh, let's just go to the bus stop, and Hopefully we can make it to bed in time. So we have 65. Oh, yeah, we can definitely get another uh, Iridium ban because we have plenty of Solar Essence and Void Essence right there. We just need to get the, is it five Iridium or something like that? So we can definitely craft it, like, right now and then combine it together with that new uh, Crab Shell Ring. So that's something to look forward to. And then we have to the green slime. We'll do that next episode. I just assume that this episode is long enough to be like 30 minutes or 40 minutes on its own. So let's just go to bed. I don't think we need to have another three day episode. So let's go to bed. And it's going to be Christmas Eve next episode. And it's going to be the Feast of the Winter Star uh, event as well. 332,000 overnight. Golly. And day 24 winter. Year three has begun. I wonder how Gungus feels with Christmas just around the corner. Is she going to get any gifts? Is she on secret uh, Santa? Whatever they call secret Santa. Is she on someone's list this year? I don't know. Hopefully she's on their nice list and not the naughty list, right? <laughs> but anyways, I think that was a pretty good episode right there, you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you guys did, be sure to let me know by leaving a like down below. And if you guys want more of these awesome videos, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And while you're down there, be sure to ring that bell so YouTube sends you a notification as soon as I upload another episode of Stardew Valley, because I assure you guys it's not going to be another three weeks like it was for this one. Hopefully I'll get back on track and uploading it like twice a week like I usually do. But until then, thank you guys all very much for watching. Okay, you're just going to run away from me then, huh, guys? I guess I'll go over here. Thank you guys all very much for watching. And I'll see you guys here next time with some more Stardew Valley. Oh, bye there. Thank <laughs> you.